hi guys welcome back to our channel again in this video we will learn what is palindrome and after that we will see how we can figure out whether a number or a string is palindrome or not and definitely we will use python programming we can use any other programming also but in this tutorial we will learn this palindrome thing using some python script or python programming so let's get it started at first let's learn what is palindrome a palindrome is a word or number or phrase or any other sequence of characters which reads the same backward as forward that means we have some letters or numbers anything is fine and if we reverse the whole thing it will be the same so that is called palindrome so let's see some of the example of palindrome so one popular example is madam m a d a m so if we reverse the string from end to beginning it will be the same then another example of palindrome is race car so if you again reverse the word from end to beginning it will be the same so that is also palindrome and let's check another number one to one if you reverse the number it will be the same so this number is a palindrome also now let's learn by some programming we'll write some small program to determine whether a word or number is palindrome or not so i am going to switch uh, my python editor so basically i am using visual studio code but you can use any other editor is fine and then after that i already created one file it is called palindrome.py py file so i will use this file to write our python script or python code to check whether a word or number is palindrome or not so let's get started now so i'm going to switch the python editor mode this is my python file palindrome.py uh, so the extension is .py as this is a python programming or python file and we'll write uh, some code at first i will define on a string suppose the string is madam and the string will be defined with the variable and the variable name is my string so this is the variable my string and inside it we define madam now we need to check whether this is a palindrome or not so we have to use if else block so i am going to use uh, the shortcut of visual studio uh, if else code block and after pressing that thing we will get this thing so now in the if clause we have to put our condition okay so we have to check uh, whether my string is equal to the reverse string okay because we need to reverse so i can define on variable it is called like reverse reverse uh, my string okay and then we can define uh, the reversed my string thing okay so basically this variable will what we will do basically we will reverse the whole string so this is my string okay now inside the second variable reversed my string we will reverse the string so here we will use the slice operation of python so i am going to define my string then inside the parenthesis that i mean inside the range i am using two colon that means start and end and then at the begin at last i have to mention minus one that means it will reverse the whole thing from start to end okay but uh, it will start from the end okay and then i am defining uh, the comparison operator in between these two my string equal equal reverse string okay and then finally if the strings are equal based on the palindrome we can do one thing print palindrome and if the uh, if my string and the reverse string are not the same that means it is not a palindrome so we can print online like not palindrome not a palindrome something like that okay that's all so that's all now let's run it and check whether it runs properly or not so after running the program i see there is an error so i put double parenthesis so i need to remove all parenthesis and after that i am going to run it again and we are seeing that this time it will run properly so here it is showing that is it is a palindrome okay so based on the checking it is showing now let's put a different thing like number one to one and let's run it and it's showing it's a palindrome now let's remove it and check whether it is not palindrome okay so i put a non palindrome or all a string or number and then we are finding that it's not a palindrome so it's very simple and easy right so you can do one thing uh, instead of uh, putting hard coded value we can uh, take input from the user so we can use the python input function so i am typing input method and inside it 
I am typing some string like enter a string. Okay, now it will take input from user and then it will check whether that odd or number is fine or not. So I am going to run the program again and let's check. So I run the program now, it is asking for a input string. So I type this input string like madam and then I hit enter key and I see it's showing that it's palindrome. Now let's try on more word uh, which is not a palindrome at all. So I'm going to type that word here. So suppose the word is boy. So this is not a palindrome and our program is showing after running uh, that not a palindrome. And that's all, guys. Uh, that is palindrome that means if you reverse the word or number it will be the same and using very few lines of python code you can check whether a word or a number is palindrome or not and hopefully uh, you understand the concept of palindrome and how to create a small program to test whether that word or a string or phrase is palindrome or not so thank you guys if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video.